there had been some uh, back and forth with uh, other family members and I believe there was a family event, a soccer game that uh, one of the children was supposed to be at, didn't show up, a family member had shown up then and had discovered the crime here at the scene. And that was a basic traffic stop, uh, traffic infraction. They made contact at the, re at the uh, vehicle and that was prior to law enforcement having been alerted to the incident that had transpired here today. Uh, in a case like this, of course, it's difficult for an entire, you know, for a family, for a community, and for law enforcement as well. Anytime a child's involved in a crime, it uh, amps up the, you know, the feelings in regards to, you know, all of our deputies or family members or parents themselves. So when something like this transpires, it's difficult on the first responders, the family, and the community at large. Obviously, in a situation like this, you want to get it resolved as quickly as possible. Again, I'd go back to the statement, if anybody makes contact with an individual, if they have phone contact with anybody, if they see anything on social media, obviously share that forward to our investigative resources. We'll look into the situation and try and get it resolved.